Facebook, I have the best way of removing the Triton dreaded 5-4 spark plugs that break off into cylinders. And here's my trick. Obviously get the engine to operating temperature. Shut it off. Pull all the spark plug coils off. If you're doing all of them, a squirt of PB blaster on the top so it can run down to the threads and seat. If you're just doing one coil and plug, fine. Identify the cylinder. Get it hot, pull the coil off, squirt a, one squirt, a little one. You know, you don't want to drown it on the top of the spark plug. Rest the coil back on, plugged in. All right, and then do a throttle body induction service. I like to use two cans of brake clean at 1,500 to 2,000 RPMs. Squirt, squirt, squirt. RPMs are up, squirt, watch the RPMs dive, and just keep doing it like that until two cans of brake clean are emptied into that engine. Uh, it will clean the intake valves. It will actually clean the shit that's built up on here that pinches this metal in the combustion chamber and the seat. What happens is the PB blaster actually starts to eat away at the crap and gum that sits in here and gets this stuck. This, the brake clean, will get all the carbon and shit off of here. So as it gets hot and expands and contracts, the PB blaster is going to soak its way down into here to make your life a lot simpler. This is the part number for the plug for it. Again, operating temperature, remove the coil on the cylinder you're working on, a squirt of PB blast or a little one. If you're doing all eight, same process. Put the coil back in, do not bolt it in, plug it in, rest it over the cylinder. Two cans through the throttle body, 1500 to 2000 RPMs. Um, and that's the best way to get these out. Simple and easy. Meineke Cinnamonson.